Hey, driving the ball long and straight is really fun and it's a great way to lower your scores too. And I know that you clicked on this video because you're not, just not satisfied with your driving game. So right after this, I'm gonna give you a really powerful yet simple exercise that's gonna help you get the club head coming into the ball at the right angle for power and accuracy. So you're, if you're ready to add 30 yards or more, please stay tuned. All right, so most golfers are not hitting the ball as long as they want because most of them are simply approaching the ball from the wrong angle. They tend to approach the ball a little too steeply this way, a little more vertically than they should and often from the outside. And this makes it very easy to both slice, but also wreck your angle of attack, hit downwards on your drives, not get a lot of carry, and overall, not a lot of distance. So I came up with the drill. I call this the sweep and roll drill. We're gonna pretend that we're on a baseball diamond. So here we have home plate, third base, second base, and of course, first base up here in this corner. All right, so what you'll do is you do about three of these per ball. You're simply gonna back up a little bit for a practice swing. And I want you to set the club down on the ground next to third base right here. Now you see already that's gonna force you to put it on the ground, force you to lower your right shoulder. It's the only way you can get it on the ground, otherwise you can't reach. So already our shoulders are at a bit of a tilt. Now all you're gonna do is you're gonna sweep this right over the pitcher's head, over first base from low to high, just like this. Just like that. Now, second thing I'm gonna have you do, because that's the sweep part of it, the roll part is making sure that you take the forearms and you get the right forearm to roll completely over the top of the left so the whole exercise just simply looks like this. Third base over the first baseman's head. Third base up over the third first baseman's head as the right forearm crosses over. Then I might move into the ball and I might do kind of a smooth driver swing, trying to retain that same feel from third to first and low to high. So let me give that a try and we'll take a look at the stats of the drive. It helped me come, you see the stats on the screen right up here, that I was able to come from the inside about four degrees in this case, but I hit up on the ball about six degrees and a very shallow and inside out attack into the ball. Completely the opposite of most golfers out there who are struggling to get distance. So I really encourage you, try this sweep and roll drill using the baseball diamond uh, visuals here, just like this. Do it about three times per ball, hit the ball gently using some of the kind of residue imagery that you have from the practice swings, and hopefully that'll get your driving game much more efficient. Higher launch, lower spin, higher smash factor. That gives you all the distance you need without even having to swing hard. Hey, try this out. And if it works for you, get back to me in the comments. Hey, I'm gonna go back and hit a few more drives just because it's so much fun. Uh, I'm Steve for HitItLonger.com. And as usual, I'll either see you in the next video or I will see you longer and straighter down the fairway. Everybody take good care.